It's a list of the dead. There are so many, no one can remember all their names. I never knew there were that many immortals. Oh no, it's everyone across Avium that fell in the Everwar. The Palathon tracks it somehow, all the way back. You know, we're still not really sure who built this place. A bit morbid, really. Having a massive death list right when you walk in, now that I think about it. Oh, hello. I'm Devin, by the way. Just got back from the front. Jack, stationed at Yilthium Fields the last few weeks. I'm from Serum, originally. Is that right? I've never met anyone from East Lucium. And you still haven't. Said I was from Seren. Ah, oh, nice. A little provincial machismo. Let me show you around, Jack. Promise it's not all a big down. I, uh, really need to get to selection. Absolutely no idea where to go. Come this way. I'll show you. I remember Kirken talking about a Jack from Seren a few times. Said you'd make a great immortal one day. Huh. She said that? No. I'm just trying to calm your nerves, man. If you don't mind me asking, how long have you been an immortal? Oh, ages. Well, a few years. But immortal years are like dog years. They stretch on and on. So you're the best of the best? You sound doubtful. It's a cheery disposition. But the Rishanians have sent writs of assassination to every quarter asking for my head. They hate me over there. I'll get some of those writs myself just as soon as I look up what writs are. I'm sure you will, especially as a triarch. We don't get many of those. Well, any of them, actually. So what's the secret? How do you do it? Dunno. I just do. I see. You just do. No need for hard work and discipline when you can just do. Good lesson for the kids. Is this part of selection? You busting my balls? <laughs> no. Selection is much worse. We're almost there. Got another one for group five. No. Oh, stop. He'll be your star pupil. Jack here's the soldier that was crucial to the rout at Yilthium Fields. Kirkin's pet initiate? I'm literally standing right here. The path is ready for this group, and I'm not asking her to reconfigure for one more. She'll complain and give everyone in the Palathon nightmares for a week. Get ready. Those doors open, you go in, one at a time. Come on, Zendara. You know the path already senses he's here. Okay, why are you talking about it like it's alive? It's not happening, Devon. On the one hand, nightmares brought about by a cranky magical gestalt conscious skin. That's okay, ignore me. It's cool. On the other, a stern lecture from Kirken for playing needlessly hardball. I know which one I'd pick. You weren't here for my speech to the selection candidates, Initiate. So I'll give you the short version. So it is happening? Shut up. Welcome to the path. Stepping through that door means you think your magic is strong enough to issue a challenge to the Pentasad. That you fear no judgment or censure for doing so, and that your life word to the ley lines is forfeit if you're found wanting. The really short version? Don't fuck up in there or you'll... <coughs> like... For real? More like absorbed into the path and removed from existence. But don't sweat it. I believe in you. She definitely thinks you're going to die. That's why her face looks like that. But don't let it shake you. And anyways, optimism is a moral imperative. I'm Zandara of House Cadus, Warden of the Path and oath sworn to the Immortals by Ancient Treaty. It was nice knowing you, Jack. Hero of Yilthium Fields. A smarter man than you would have ended this day on a high note. Isn't she great?
Caleb, he gave this to Luna on her birthday. Right before everything. Saren. Bits of it, anyway. I called dibs on the shoes. Caleb? First time fumbling about in Saren. What? I grew up here. Don't move, shitbird. Best crab in the Harrows. Kill most. But we both know that's not really crab. How far from here to Trotter's place? <laughs> By a rooftop. He's Saren born and bred, guys. Settle down. Where's your people? I don't know. You need any more? That was the day I met Luna and the others. I guess we're not playing fair anymore. But it's fuck huge, so probably a lot. There's just the five of us. Then eventually we might all get really lonely. Who cares? Come on! Check her out. That whole thing? Whole thing. How are we gonna defend that whole thing? What? What? We squat a place like that, we need to figure out how to keep it. Nah, it's ours. I bought it. How did you... What? Where did... It's not a mystery, Jack. I saved up. I wanted a house and now I have one. All of us do. She was so proud that she found us a home. And that... That was the last time I actually had one. Thanks for the reminder.
is everyone? I sent them all home. You're the only one to pass. R really? Follow me, Initiate. Let's head back up. right about you. That you'd surprise me. Seems like Kirkin really talked me up to everyone. I don't mean Kirkin. I mean the path. She knows I don't expect much from the unforeseen. Are we heading towards a backhanded compliment, or... We zoomed right past it. Okay. Magni of the Great Houses don't exactly hide their prejudices, do they? Against your kind. We have good reasons. My kind? Wow. You know, just because I, uh, spontaneously exploded with Magnus-level magic or whatever doesn't mean that Don't I- Don't worry, Initiate. I won't let it cloud my judgment of you. You're different. How so? You're one of us now. Sandrak's western incursion has been pushed back to the Sky Islands. Only his harriers remain. Hey, congratulations. And so what now, I hear you ask? Surrounded, but for now unpressed, do we send our forces north to lift the siege at Lavenry? Or fortify the southern front? Marshal our strength? Or test its limits? I'll be honest, I don't know which move is best. But I do know, we have reinforcements. We do? She means you, dummy. Welcome, Jack of the House Unforeseen. Newly mantled immortal, champion protector of Lucium, master Magnus of the Order Elite. What words do you have for those under our command? Are you serious? They're waiting for your answer. Don't take five years. <clears throat> Hey, so, so when I was a kid, I had this friend that wanted to fight in the Ever War. I can't believe I, that I used to give her a hard time about it. She never got a chance to, um, well, Rasharn attacked and, uh, well, I don't even have to finish that sentence. Everyone here has a story that starts or ends with Rasharn attacked. And everyone here has survived those stories. But there are so many that didn't. Too many. Their names fill the walls of this place. No more names. No more names. May all of Lucium honor yours until the end of days. Whoa. Bottoms up? So, what now? This is your party, Jack. Mingle. All eyes are on you. Mingle. Bask, even. What about the stolen artifact? It was like a big, glowy crystal with etchings all over it. We're scouring the archives. Nothing yet. Go enjoy yourself. Get to know some of the people you'll be working with. Or if the pressure to socialize is too much to bear, head to your new quarters and turn in for the night. Good night, sir. Good night, Jack. Mingle.
These are my quarters. Morning, sir. I think I might have, well, accidentally slept in the wrong broom. It's kind of, uh, extravagant and really big. You'll get used to it. Come down to the vault. We need to talk about your next steps as a new one. Will do. Now that you're an immortal, Jack, do you want to know a secret? <laughs> that you actually have hobbies? These all yours? What do you think of them? I think I haven't seen enough of the world. I don't recognize any of these. That's because they all were driven to extinction by the Ever War. How? Since we first learned to use magic, We've waged war over who would control it. It isn't meant to be used so violently, and so unchecked, and for so long. The natural world suffers for it. Their habitats die. Their waters are ruined, their skies are choked, their lands are crystallized or filled with hungry spirits they can't compete with. Our magic causes ruin for every living thing, Jack. It causes the wound. We caused the wound? I told you that we draw magic from the ley lines, from the shrouded realm. To be more precise, we siphon it to use as we will. And it stays here. But it's not meant to. And no one's ever discovered how to actually put it back. Punches its way back down. All that magic over all that time. And so the wound grows. But without magic... We can't win the war to control magic. Correct. So we're destroying Avium while we're trying to save Avium? That's the secret. This secret sucks. It's insane. Does Sandrak know this? Of course he does. All the Orders do. Then why the hell are we fighting? Everyone needs to just stop. You want to be the first side to quit? Because you trust Sandrak that much. Because mankind can always be counted on to do the reasonable thing. I've wanted to wield magic my whole life. And now you're telling me I... <laughs> You've already figured out the solution, Jack. We win. Then we start thinking about how to fix the wound. You don't win in ever war. It's brick walls like that make you take up painting in your spare time. Isn't there something else th that we can do about it, I mean? Yes. Go to that spell altar. What spell will it grant me? One that hopefully eases your conscience.
Reckless, overtaxed, and broken magic often leaves corruption behind. You grew up with it in Saren, the deposits that would accumulate in the Underbridge. There, it's a nuisance. But larger, more malignant versions exist. Part of the Immortals' mandate is to restore those areas of the world overrun with this corruption. That spell is the key. Restore them. With magic. The same magic that causes it and, oh yeah, also the wound. The irony isn't lost on anyone. In the meantime, you have more pressing concerns. Zendara's waiting for you in the war chamber to brief you on a mission. Really? Please don't say she's my field commander. Run along. Your field commander's waiting. Clock's ticking. Yes, sir. Uh, you do outrank me, right? I, <laughs> wow, this place is kind of big. I uh, must have gotten lost. Huh. 
intel indicates that the hand is operating near the Pale Forest, and we've just lost contact with our outpost there. What's so important about the forest? Strategically, nothing. The Leyline Tower there has been dead for a hundred years. And yet she's taking a big risk attacking so close to the Palathon. You still with me, Initiate? Not an Initiate. That's not even a rank. Y you know, I checked. Nightblades have established a stronghold at the southern edge of the forest. We'll attack on both sides. We? Are you coming? I mean, what about Devin? Devin is needed elsewhere. And Kirkin seems to think you might not get me killed. Jury's still out on that one. Sure, thanks. Don't leave the portal open for me or anything. Guess I'm walking.